hey everybody and welcome back if you want to see how i did this look please keep on watching hello again and uh, my brows are already done so i'm just gonna go in and prime my eyelids using the la girl pro conceal in almond and i'm just gonna blend that with a beauty blender To prevent the concealer from creasing, I'm just gonna set it with my airspan loose powder. Taking my ashes uh, eyeshadow palette, I'm just gonna use the color for my transition and put that in my crease. And then I'm gonna take my BH Cosmetics Party Girl palette and use that dark brown there to deepen my crease. Now taking a much darker brown color from the same palette, I'm just gonna further deepen my crease. I'm using a, a flat brush for this because I only want the dark color to be in my crease and not all over the eyelid. And finally, I'm just going to blend everything together using the blending brush that I use to apply my transition color with. And then next, we're just going to cut the crease uh, using concealer and the small concealer brush. My brush is actually a little bit bigger, but then if you have uh, something smaller, you can use that. Next, I'm just going to apply my winged eyeliner and I'm going to use the MAC Gel Eyeliner in black uh, using my small eyeliner brush. I'm just going to carefully, carefully line that so that I don't mess it up this time. <laughs> I decided to put a little twist to this eye look by applying gold, gold eyeliner on my uh, crease line using a small eyeliner brush. I applied my lashes off camera and now we're gonna move in into highlighting and contouring. I highlighted using the LA Girl Pro Conceal uh, HD Concealer in Almond. So I'm just gonna place that under my eyes, on the bridge of my nose, on my forehead, on my cupid's bow, and on my chin. And I'm just gonna use a beauty blender to blend everything out. Next, taking my LA Girl Pro Coverage uh, Foundation in the shade uh, dark chocolate. I'm just going to use that to contour my face. And to set my highlight, I'm going to use the S Pan Loose Powder. And I'm gonna use my dirty beauty blender <laughs> please don't mind it uh, 
I know it's dirty, but it's working perfectly for me. So I'm just gonna use that. Uh, I don't know how I missed the bridge of my nose and applied that on the side, but anyway, happens. Next, going in with the Black Radiance True Complexion Contour Palette, I'm just gonna set that contour using a contouring brush. And to blend everything together, I just went in with the uh, Beauty Blender. For my blush, I use the MAC uh, blush in the shade Pinch Me. It's my current favorite. If you have noticed, I've been using it in quite a number of tutorials now. Next, taking my baked highlighter powder. Uh, this is the Golden Lights by Revolution. I'm just going to apply that uh, above my cheeks. And for lipstick, I went in with the Lime Crime Liquid Lipstick in the shade Fetish. And this was the moment that I realized I hadn't done my under eyes, so I almost freaked out. So going in back to the Ashes palette, I took the, the color that I used on my cut, on my crease, and uh, I applied that on my... Uh, lash line using a small flat brush well what's crazy is I actually told myself that I'm actually done but then when I looked into the mirror that's when I saw that um, I wasn't really so yeah going in into the other um, BH cosmetics uh, palette I took the brown and applied it on top of the the first color that I applied. Basically all the colors that I applied on my crease are just going to go down on my uh, on my lash line. And then uh, taking the Maybelline Colossal uh, Black Eyeliner, I, uh, I lined my waterline. And then I went back uh, with a small flat brush and just blended the black out. So yeah, that's my final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Uh, don't forget to uh, like my Facebook page, Beauty by Raz. And also follow me on Instagram at Beauty by Raz. But also don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, uh, Beauty by Raz. So Thank you for watching and see you next time.